Good morning, YouTubers. This is Johnny. Um, today I'm gonna introduce how to improve your sepans performance. There's a couple of ways you can improve your sepan server's performance. If you have DR side, you can have load balancing settings between your main sepan server and the DR sepan server. If that's not an option and you are facing performance issue, I can show you a quick trick to change the community set, communication settings to make your SEPEN performance much better. Let's log into SEPEN right now. Here is the main interface. You logged in to your second server through the web browser. So we need to change the policy settings on the communication, the communication between your client and your server. I mean, second server. So go to the policies. It's not there, it's in the client. Even we need to change the policy, it's under the client's page. Here is the policies. They listed all location independent policies and the location specific policy. We need to look at the location independent policies and the settings section. You will find the communication here. Click through it. Then you can see here. The settings, how the client, the SAP client, communicate to the SAP and server management server. So there's a download policies and content from the management server. Right now we are using push mode. Push mode means once there's changes, the management server immediately push the policy changes to client. So usually to save the second server's performance, we change it from push mode to pull mode. We ask client to pull it from the management server. Habit interval says five minutes. We don't have to change that. If you want to improve that, you can change it to 30 minutes as well. But now the major impact for the performance of SEPEN is download randomization. And randomization here, you need to enable randomization. Right now it's five minutes. I was just put the 30 minutes here. So that will ask the client when there's a new content, new signature, when they need downloading content from the management server, they will have 30 minutes of randomization. <clears throat> Save the settings here. That's pretty much everything you need to change. You need to wait a couple of minutes until the habit five minutes time to reach the client's talk to the server to get those uh, changes. And then they will change the behavior, how they can uh, communicate to the Server, how clients gonna communicate to the server? They gonna pull changes and with randomization in thirty minutes. That's a little small changes, but that's gonna increase your seven servers performance a lot. Um, if you have questions, please let me know. Uh, if you like video, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.